Hey, YouTube, what's up? Um, just want to get on here and say, um, that it is World International Thyroid Awareness Week. It started yesterday. Um, it runs from May 25th to... Let's see if I can get it up here. Just give me a minute. My computer's being a little finicky. I'm installing a video editing program. Okay, so this week is International Thyroid Awareness Week, and it runs from May 25th, which was yesterday, to Friday, May 31st. And if you want to follow it on uh, follow any of the tweets, uh, Facebook status updates, uh, or anything on um, anywhere on social media. The hashtag is hashtag ITAW19, International Thyroid Awareness Week 19. Um, you can also visit thyroidweek.org and thyroid-fed.org um, man, my face looks puffy right there I'm not sure what's going on I think maybe I've been eating too much of the wrong kind of food the last couple of days um, which I have um, when you're broke Trying to eat right with hypothyroidism is a real challenge. So I've been eating all the wrong kinds of foods. I've been eating pizza, which is greasy and and um, not very healthy. Um, I had pepperoni pizza from Marcos. Um, I tried to really kind of tone it down as much as I could calorie wise but the other stuff that's on it is really gross so um, and I also had some cheesy bread which again gross cheesy greasy stuff yeah um, things I did do healthy this week is, or this the last few days being broke is um, I've tried to eat as much meat as I can. I ate some really disgusting processed macaron frozen macaroni and cheese that you can heat up in the microwave the other night. Ugh. Gross, gross, gross. I'm going to tell you, once you start eating healthy, once you start eating healthy, and um, start eating the right kind of foods when you have a condition like what I do um, it really when you get off track a little bit you can feel it you can really feel it and I think maybe like I said maybe that's a little bit why my face is puffy because um, of all the nasty stuff I've had to eat because I've been broke. Um, I need to do better at meal prep. 100%. I, I, uh, I make no excuses for that. I need to do better. Um, I do okay. Like if I'm going to the store, I really try to read labels and stuff. Um, unfortunately, there's not really an app out there that I know of that gives you a uh, nutritional breakdown of stuff before you go to the grocery store so that you can make 
better and quicker informed decisions when you're picking out more of your processed foods like your sauces and your um, your add-ons like your beans uh, your canned beans and and that kind of stuff um, anybody that subscribes to this channel or watches this video if you know of any apps drop them in the comments below I am all for trying to find something that's gonna make me a, a better advocate for myself and for others so like I said if you know of apps out there that give nutritional information of foods on top of the uh, the regular uh, options that they give for whatever um, whatever their platform is like I know um, I know Google Fit only does gives you an option for like tracking your weight and your steps and um, something else um, Spark People does a okay job of giving you caloric breakdowns of stuff um, and I, I think they also give you like a fat breakdown but they don't tell you how much sugars are in the what you're uh, planning for the week um, you are able to plan your meals with spark people um, lose it uh, I, I believe you can get that information from Lose It, but I think you have to pay a premium. Um, what are the other apps that I have on this? Um, I think that's it. I have Spark People, Lose It, and Google Fit. Um, I am going to, at some point in time, go through the different apps and I, how I use them and maybe how I could be using them better. Um, and go from there. Uh, let's see what else has been going on this week. Um, I have a doctor's appointment on the 29th. Uh, I'm not sure exactly. Um, I can't remember what I'm going to the doctor's for. Oh, I do. Uh, I believe it's just for um, my f annual physical either my annual physical or med checkup um, and then um, if that's the case then um, I'm, I'm probably going to be doing my lab results again um, or lab tests again um, with Anthony being out of school now Anthony graduated from high school last, last week last weekend and with him being out of high school now um, I've got to really uh, get myself on a better schedule ish I don't do schedules very well but um, I've got to start doing something that's going to benefit and make me productive so um, I think I'm going to really break, uh, I think I'm going to really, um, what's the word I'm looking for? I, I'm going to really buckle down, there we go, buckle down, that's it. I'm going to really buckle down and, um, work really hard on building this channel and, getting more information out there for you guys um, I think really that's about it um, for now um, if uh, you want to keep up to date with what I'm doing um, hit the subscribe button and also hit the um, uh, hit that notification bell and again this is International Thyroid Awareness Week so from May 25th through May 31st 
and if you want to follow what is going on in the world of uh, thyroid awareness is, and also um, hypothyroidism, uh, please follow hashtag ITAW19. I'll put that in the description below and also um, in the, the description for this video. Uh, and, uh, where you can also stay up to date. Uh, oh, I do want to say really quick. Let me go. Let me find it. Just give me a second. In America, if you're if you are uh, in the United States and you are following me uh, I want you to know that you can get uh, thyroid information for the United States at the American Thyroid Association website and you can find that at thyroid.org www.thyroid.org so, um, anyway, that's, that's what's going on this week, um, this coming week, I should say, uh, I'm going to try to have resources for you on, uh, different things for hypothyroidism throughout the coming week, and, um, again, subscribe, hit the notification button, leave me comments on different apps that you use um, and um, I'll also leave uh, in the description below different apps that I'm using and um, let's support each other have a good night bye